And more than 80 trauma professionals received a big honor tonight. The Shock Trauma Center celebrated the physician who saved the lives of two critically injured patients. Casey Baylor is on your corner tonight in Baltimore. And Casey, you spoke with those patients who say they wouldn't be here today without shock trauma. Kelsey, they credit shock trauma staff for aiding in their road to recovery. Now they say it wasn't just the medical response that helped them heal, but it was also that additional care staff provided to them during their stay at the hospital. Frederick County Farmer Zine Wolf and Montgomery County Police Sergeant Patrick Kep both share painful memories. While I was working on the farm, I was crushed in a skid loader and it broke up my pelvis and did some internal injuries. We were trying to stop a driver who was known to us, tried to bait the police into chases. He intentionally struck and ran me over and it resulted in the loss of parts of both of my legs. Their separate stories led them to the shock trauma center where they received weeks long care and it's care they'll never forget. They don't treat you like a job even though they're being paid. It's not just the medical care, it's the personal care, the, the mental side of things. The many people who saved their lives got a big thank you Saturday night. Shock trauma hailed several medical professionals as heroes inside the Hippodrome Theater and commended them on their life saving work. If not everybody does their job, it doesn't work out so well. And so to come together and, and do this one night at least, is uh, it's just a special experience. Kep and Wolf say they couldn't be more thankful. Not only just thank you for doing the work, but thank you for being by my side the entire time. They are the true heroes of, of the story. of. And proceeds from tonight's event will advance critical initiatives focused on trauma prevention, violence intervention research, as well as education and training. Reporting live on your corner in Baltimore City, I'm Casey Baylor for WJZ.